Alright, I'm gonna cut to whenever I get my encounter here, cause... No! No! What is going on guys, it's your boy Jay, back with another episode of the Brilliant Diamond Hardcore Nuzlocke. And we're very clearly not in Silesian Town, because today is the episode. We go in the underground, get some encounters, and then make our way to Wayward Cave. Hopefully, don't screw up our encounters on our, on our way there, so that we can ensure that we get the Gibble later on in the game. So yeah, that's pretty much the plan for today. If we have time after Wayward Cave, I might try to make my way over to Veilstone, but I doubt we're going to have time to fit in the gym battle today, but we'll, we'll see how far we can get with things. But yeah, with that out of the way, let's get into the episode, folks. Alright, so these two top and bottom caves here are typically where Magnemite spawn. They're both the same type of cave, so once I choose one and I get my encounter, I can't go into the other one to get a second encounter, right? So I just have to choose one and hope that a Magnemite is in there. So we're gonna go, we'll go with this one. I'm closer this way. We'll just, we'll just go down here. Come on, Magnemite. Why? 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 <laughs> is there even a Magnemite in here? You've gotta be kidding me. My encounter is freaking Lickitung. Really, my guy? Like, I could've reset this room if I never saw that freaking Lickitung. Alright, no, I got a Baneer. Yeah, I already got a Baneer. Oh my god, you've got to be kidding me. Alright, well... Let me, let me set up for this encounter, because... I'm stuck getting a freaking lick of tongue now. Alright, I'm gonna start with, um... Voltron. Get an Intimidate off. Go into Staravia, get another Intimidate off. Intimidate cycle a bit so that I can, you know, survive some hits and try to catch this stupid freaking Pokemon. Oh my god, I can't! I don't, what, am, what am I gonna call this stupid thing? Uh, uh, let's see, we'll call you, we'll call you, just, we'll, we'll call, we're, we're gonna call it Envelope because, I mean, I feel like, I feel like if Pokemon were real, Lickitung would be perfect for licking Envelope's clothes. That would be its job. I'm never gonna use this thing, so it doesn't even matter to me. Look, I'm actually mad. Watch, let me let me go in and out and see if I can get a Magnemite. One minute, 37 seconds later. Those steel statues did nothing. All of my grinding and all the hours I spent mining were for nothing. All right, well, let's go back up. We have to go... We have to encounter, let's encounter the Ponyta at Route 211, so let's go do that. Uh, not only would a Magnemite be a useful Pokemon, it would have helped me so much better. Fine. Did I fight these people already? Yeah, 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 I did. Alright. I'm gonna cut to whenever I get my encounter here, cuz... No! No! Like, what are really the chances that my first encounter on this route would be a Chingling? The exact same thing happening right Like, Literally, literally, RNG Jesus is just me right now, okay? This is exactly what happened on my Renegade Platinum playthrough. First encounter was a Chingling on this very same route. A freaking Chingling. Man. I probably should have healed my Pokemon before I went into this battle. I'm gonna call you Ling Ling. Like Ding a Ling a Ling Ling. Uh, we'll put a space in this. I wasn't gonna, but we'll do it. Ling Ling. All right, Ling Ling. Ling a Ling a Ling a Ling. Uh, we don't have Fly. No, that's my other playthrough. Let me make my way back to Salisian Town now. All right. Actually, I forgot. We also have to get an encounter route 206, and then possibly go into Wayward Cave. Well, I might as well just uh. Let me see. Is there any way I can like, you know, cheese the encounter? Maybe try and get. Alright, well, I'm probably gonna get a point on this route, which is gonna piss me off. Or a scun tank. Oh, Jesus loves me! 
I didn't even have to get the Magnemite. Okay, let's go. Let's freaking go. Bronzong is a good Pokemon too. Okay. Things are looking up for us. Things are looking real up. Let's go. Alright, we're gonna call Bronzer Decibel. Cause you know. Bells or not bells, it's it's a it's a giant yeah, yeah it's a bell. It's a giant like bell gong thing. Not a gong, it's a bell. It's a, it's a bell and bells make sound and sound is measured in decibels, you know what I'm saying? They're also really loud, which also works, you know? Uh, okay, let's throw over Pella now that we got our encounter. Alright, now let's hit up Wayward Cave, find Mira, and help her get out. Um, actually... Oh, I forgot I need Flash for this cave. Come on. Alright, yeah. I'm gonna switch my team. Just for this gym. Or not for this gym, for this... Oh my god, I don't think I have anything that's appropriate level. Envelope? No! You've gotta be kidding me. I have to actually use Envelope? Oh, this is garbage. Alright, yeah, so, uh, <laughs> this is my, uh, cave team to keep my main team a little bit under-leveled so I don't go over-level. And, yeah. Yeah. This is, this is well, a pathetic team as of right now. I mean, if these Pokemon were evolved, they'd be okay, but they're not. So this is a pathetic team, and I'm literally relying on Envelope to carry me through this entire cave, which is probably going to be a mistake, but that's fine. If Envelope dies, I don't really care. Also, I have to use Flash. Hold on. Why wouldn't they just put Flash in the in the freaking in the watch? What? Why did why did they do this to us? All right, let's go find Mira. I've come to save you, Mira. I'm here. I was catching Pokemon and then I got lost. I'm so scared. Please, please take me to the exit. Let's go then. Let's get on out of here. Let's get the Fizznuck out of here, guys. Oh, is it an encounter? Crap. Imagine if one of those was shiny. Would have been great. That would have been like amazing luck. Alright, we are gonna get the hell up out of dodge, though. I also have, like, three more repels, so I'm probably gonna run out of repels before I make it out of this cave, so... <laughs> That's annoying. Cool, 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 cool. I got two repels, actually. What? Oh, right. God damn it. Alright, well... Let's get through some double battles. Ah, let's go! Yes! Oh, I love it here. Let's go, low pony. Let's go, one of my favorite Pokemon. It looks so freaking good. It looks so freaking good. Oh, I love it. here let's go let's go oh there's the exit i want oh there's the exit i want to get tougher so i i won't be such a scaredy cat jay bye bye thank you bye felicia bye felicia all right let's head on back to Celestia on town folks let's go all right so i forgot to press unpause on my on the recording but we are currently inside the lost tower that was my encounter. We just caught a Murkrow. 
for our, I think, I think, is it called a Lost Tower? I think it's called Lost Tower. Yeah, we just got a Mur Murkrow for Lost Tower. I'm gonna call you the obvious Nightwing. Like, well, how can you, how could you not? Right? All right, yeah, so our encounter for Lost Tower was that Murkrow. Gotta heal up my team. But as I was saying to the not recording camera, as I was trying to catch that Murkrow, first of all, this place looks freaking gorgeous. Like, this is a, a big improvement from the old games. But secondly, I love the fact that these little tombstones are in here now. Let me, let me pop a repel. Yeah, I love that these, are, that, that these little tombstones are in here because whenever I do thumbnails and I put tombstones on the thumbnails, the fact that the thumbnails don't really match up with the art of, you know, the Pokemon games always kind of throws me off. But now I can just take a picture of these tombstones and then, boom, put it on my thumbnails for the future. Anyways, let's get through this cave, or this cave, this tower real quick, like, guys. I also put some, uh, some seals on Fran's Pokeball. If you did not notice, um, I don't have anything really to deal with a Stunky, so we're just gonna have to use Quick Attacks. Let's go! Don't pay back me. Nice. Oh, shells. Okay, 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 okay. I could Grass Knot you, or I can go into Tuxedo Mask. Let's go into Tuxedo Mask and hit you with an Absorb. And hope I don't die in the process. Alright. Okay. Okay. Not too bad. Not too bad. Not too bad. Not too bad. Let's go Absorb. Get some health back. Oh, that did a nice bit of damage for a little Badu. For a little Badu. Why well, would it do Water Pulse? I resist that, don't I? Yeah, I resist. At least with, um... Maybe Stun Spark. At, oh, come on. At least with Mud Slap, it's neutral. And it re reduces my accuracy, so now my Stun Spark is definitely not gonna hit. So, let's just keep using Absorb. Come on. Oh, come on. This is going to be so annoying. Do I have Levitate? Yes, I do. Yes, I do. Can't hit me with no ground moves. I got Levitate, so screw you. Ha ha. I swear to God. Yeah, I swear to God. The game reads your input sometimes, because why would they do Harden? That makes no sense. Uh, no sense. I resist that, right? I, doesn't steel resist? Is it the other way around? I never remember if steel resists water or water resists steel. I know it's one or the other. I'm pretty sure it's one or the other. And I'm, I'm assuming water resists steel, which actually makes sense. Bruh. Bruh. Alright. Forget this. We're going back into, into Fran. Yeah, we're going back into Fran. And we're just gonna hit it as hard as possible because I'm not playing this game. Frickin' poison. Oh my god, come on! We're gonna be here forever. We're actually gonna be here forever. Okay, I think I have to switch out or else I go down to the poison. Cool, cool, cool. I love that for me. You know what? You know what? I'm gonna keep playing this stupid game. I'm gonna keep playing this stupid game. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We'll see about that. 
Let me get like two of these off. Watch. Come on, hit it. Let's go. Get stunned, you bastard. Let's go. That's what you deserve. Getting right what you deserve. All right. Hit it with absorbs now. What you freaking get? Play stupid game, win super prizes. Yeah! Yeah! Get out of my freaking house! Can't believe he just tried to freaking recover stall me. Like, what? Cricket tune. Yeah, we gonna have to get the hell up out of Dodge now. Except now, I don't really have anything for this Pokemon. Um, well, let's see what moves it has. Because if it only has sound-based moves, I can go into Pennywise here. Even though I don't think Pennywise has a damaging attack. I'm gonna find out. Gonna learn today. Let's confuse you. Ridiculous. Ridiculous. The frickin' confusion damaged more than my attack. That's pathetic. I'm gonna be here all day. This stupid battle. One eternity later. My freaking god, that was the most insufferable battle I ever had to endure so far. Jesus. Jesus. Orange Jesus. <sighs> Alright, let's get through this freaking stupid tower. Oh, you're a polka fan? You're gonna have like four freaking Pichus, aren't you? What did I say? What did I say? The man has three Pichus. I haven't even gone through the Lost Tower in my other playthrough because I forgot to go through it. And I, that, I just took a guess. I took a wild guess in the dark, all right. Guess stab quick attack. You did. Oh, you got a Pikachu. Okay. Bro. Bro. Get freaking bodied, Pikachu. Like, you actually, you actually have garbage stats. Oh, crap. Yo, you have garbage stats. Garbage. Alright, one more Pichu and we're out of here. Out of here. We outie. We outie. Yo, you like a belly button. Alright, what are you guys dealing with? Amber Palm. Amber Palm and Ponyta. Okay, Ponyta and Buizel. Well, that was half right. I think we can stay in on this. Yeah, yeah, we should be good. We should be good to stay in. Uh, we can go Grass Knot, but let's go Quick Attack. Into the Buizel. And then... And use it. Let's use Force Palm on the Ponyta and hope for the Paralyze. Per paralyze? Paralyze. Par paralysis. Okay, okay. Tackle. That's a lot of damage for a tackle. What? Growl works on both? Stupid. So stupid. Get paralyzed? Ugh. Alright. Um. You know what? 
two can play that game. And I'll go Force Palm onto... No, you know what? Let's just take it. Take all of these Pokemon. Uh, I'm less afraid of Weasel. So we'll go Quick Attack into Ponyta and Force Palm into Ponyta. That should take it out. Unless they growl again. Oh. Oh, dear. Okay. We might as well switch out. We still got to switch out. That'll help me stay alive if I get hit again. Yeah. Yeah, that definitely saved me. Come on, my guy. Alright. Um, who can live? You do not have heat proof. Scuba? You're the only one who might be able to live anything. At the very least, you survive or you resist the fire attack. Oh, come on! Alright, alright, okay, okay. Weasel's still good to go. I can live... I can live a, a, a bite. Barely! God damn! God damn, Weasel! Right, we're gonna go boom here. Boom here, boom here. Boom here, boom there. <laughs> uh, okay, so you're doing bites. I can I can go into tuxedo mask. Maybe I should it. No 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 actually. Or we'll just do two quick attacks. <laughs> yeah, that's what I thought. What are you gonna do now, your little friend, huh? What are your little friend to help you, huh? Now you're done for. Now you're freaking done for, aren't you? Lower your defense. How about that? I forgot I used quick attack, so that, that strategy did not work the way I wanted it to. Ooh! No. I don't even don't even try that quick attack with me. Let's see. Oh, I just gotta stay in and hope I don't get quick attack. Oh, I can double quick attack. Here we go. I will say, Fran should be the fastest thing on the field anyway, so we should be fine, but you know. That was a little, that was a little, uh, a little tougher than I had uh, expected it to be, not gonna lie. Not gonna lie to you guys. Um, actually, is Charm the one that infatuates? Oh, this harshly lowers. Ooh. Like, this is priority. But this harshly lowers attack, and that could be really useful. Low Pony is pretty fast, so you know what? I'm gonna go for the Charm. Beth and Bob. Beth and Bob. Uh, 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 uh. Beth and Bob. Beth and Bob. I don't know what just happened there. My god, this tower is proving to be harder than I expected. I mean, these all all of my Pokemon are pretty freaking underwhelming, so I, I don't... I'm not too surprised that I'm having trouble right now. Alright, what, what, what are you losers got, huh? What are you losers dealing with? Losers, Nat and Mike. Mischievous and Murkrow. Oh, this could be a problem. This could be a problem, folks. Um, so first things first, let's charm the Murkrow. Uh, yeah, this is a problem. For sure, it's a problem. I don't know if that fairy typing protects it from ghost attacks. I don't think it does. Oh, you know what I can do? Hey, hey, let's go. Let's go. Drop that. Drop that attack by two. Protect it from your wing attack. Protect it from your astonish. Let's go. Nah, you're good to go, friend. Now we quick attack here. We know it's gonna use wing attack and astonish. Decibel should be able to eat both of those. Cause I don't think I Oko is Murkrow. If I do, great. If I don't, Decibel should be okay. I cracked my wrist. Yeah, I didn't think so. 
Oh, they're smart. They use Gust because I lowered his attack. You're freaking clever, huh? You're freaking clever, eh? Alright, well, let's get rid of Mr. Vis's attack then. Since it wants to use Astonish. I can definitely live another Astonish. Let's confuse Murkrow. Interesting choice. Oh, screw off. I'm gonna go quick attack into Murkrow. Um, maybe go back into Ohm. Yeah. Yeah, we're well, going back into Ohm. Because why would it use a flying move, right? Oh, come on. Hit yourself, hit yourself, hit yourself, hit yourself, hit yourself, hit yourself. Oh, it was the BS. Why would it wing attack freaking thing? Why would it wing attack when it did it? It didn't. It's fine. It's fine. They're not cheating. Oh, you're you're trying to hurt me, hurt me, eh? You're really trying to make me feel the pain, huh? I don't appreciate that. Do not freaking appreciate that, ma'am. Get side beamed. Get stabbed. Super effective side beamed. Yeah, water gun. Let's go. Get rid of tackle. I don't need tackle. I don't need tackle. Hypnosis, yes. Well, that's gonna be so good for catching things. Get rid of confuse, right? Hit the side beam. Get one freaking job. Now I have to switch out because I can't really do anything here to Mischievous. Um, I guess I have to go into Pennywise, don't I? Don't I? Side beam again. Oh, come on, screw off. Nice. Oh, it's gonna take a while. Let's go. Come on, hit it with confusion. Just hit it. Hit it. Hit it. Oh, uh, let's go. Big W. Big W. All right. I don't remember what's at the top of this one in, in Diamond and Pearl. I think in... Oh, they might give you the... the, the, the... What's I'm gonna call it? The tag? The tag that, like, cleanse tags? Yeah, I think, they, I think they'll give you the cleanse tag or the spell tag, one or the other. Let me make your journey out of this place less frightening. Take this. Yeah, cleanse tag. Does she give me the spell tag on the other side? Lost Towers. Oh, let's go! What is that? What is that? Strength? What the hell then? Did not expect to get that. Alright, I'm gonna wrap up the episode here, guys. Because this backtrack went way longer than I expected it to, but that's fine. Now we're all caught up. We have all of our encounters from when we started the game until now. Actually, we don't have a Mount Coronet encounter, but I'm going to save that just in case because Mount Coronet is a big area. So save that just to make sure I don't pooch, screw the pooch on that encounter, right? But yeah, anyways, 
I'm gonna wrap this one up so y'all know what it is. If you enjoyed the video, make sure to slap that like and subscribe for more Pokemon content. And I'll catch you guys next time. Peace.